To make your audio sound muffled in Reaper once you have your audio recording done, we'll have to go to view and make sure that the effects browser is enabled. If it is enabled, you're gonna want to go right here and you will be looking for equalizer. Pick it up and then we'll go and choose VST Reaper EQ and you want to drag this effect onto your audio clip. We'll make it a little bit larger to have a better view and I'll just go to the default view and we don't really need all of these bands so I'll delete the redundant ones and we only need two right here and now uh, you can either control them by you know dragging these dots or you can tweak it with the knobs but first of all we need to change the type right here to high shelf and what we will want to do is cut out the higher end frequencies because the audio becomes muffled you get this muffled sound effect whenever there's an object that is block blocking the sound source and it usually absorbs the higher end uh, frequencies and the lower end frequencies tend to get passed through this so with equalizer we are mimicking this effect by cutting out the higher end frequencies and so the more you'll cut out the more muffled it will become and we'll adjust the bandwidth right here a bit so it's a bit steeper and we'll reduce the gain and really um i guess this would be the sweet spot but the settings will differ for for everyone as i mentioned the more we'll cut out the more muffled it will become but now i'll play the original one and then we'll switch to the muffled sound effects so you can see the difference this is a sample order to check whether we can make this whole thing sound a little bit muffled in Reaper. This is a sample order to check whether we can make this whole thing sound a little bit muffled in Reaper. This is a right. So as you can see, the more I cut out, the more of the effect you have, the more muffled it will become, and that's it. That's essentially all there is to making your audio sound muffled in Reaper.